Ivy joins us now to tell us more about this. Well, the first female senior advocate of Nigeria, most know what she's talking about when she discusses education. What other issues did she raise as regards Nigeria's education system? Uh, well, uh, she, she taught Latin in a university outside this country for years. So I think uh, her suggestions should be taken seriously. One of those issues she raised is the quality of the graduates coming out from the universities and higher institutions. She said most times uh, when she, she interacts with some of them, she realized that they can barely express themselves. And that for her was uh, of serious concern. She also spoke on um, reading culture in the country, you know, uh, especially when it pertains to the youth. Uh, she's worried that these days they tend to you know, depend totally on the internet, even when they are giving assignments at home. Uh, you, 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 you see that they copy uh, from the internet, they just copy and paste, and uh, they, they don't read anymore. That, she says, is also very worrisome. Uh, she, she's, she's advocating a state of emergency, as, uh, you know, in the education cent uh, sector in the country. We see the event, the event also featured uh, other distinguished personalities, especially legal luminaries. Uh, what solutions were preferred there as we get to improving the justice system? Uh, senior advocate of uh, Nigeria, Femi Falano, was the guest speaker. So he spoke extensively on justice. He said he's worried that the way uh, justice is being dispensed in the country you know, uh, between the rich and the poor, that uh, what you see in our prisons, uh, many uh, poor people, while the rich who are uh, indicted in, uh, in corruption cases, tend to, to find their way around some of these cases. Uh, he mentioned the fact that once a case is in court, that's when some of the accused will, uh, you know, suddenly develop health uh, uh, challenges and ask to be, you know, taken out of the country to attend to their health issues. He said, if the, if the country is not careful, okay. we will have the poor taking uh, the laws into their hands once they lose confidence in the justice system of the country. Correspondent Ivy Kano there joined us live from here in Lagos.